what's good guys thanks for tuning into my channel guys I wanted to come and show you guys my hair after I retwisted it after going for three and a half months with no retwist so I wanted to come and show you guys how my locks dropped after cleaning up those nappy roots guys we're looking at 12 month locks I've been locked for a year February 28th made my one year lock anniversary. The last retwist was a little bit before Thanksgiving. So that was the last time I retwisted my hair. And guys, this time when I retwisted my hair, let me just pull it up a little bit so you guys can see. Let's move it back. Last time I retwisted my hair, guys, I use a no clip method. I do not like those clips. So this time, guys, when I did my retwist, I actually retwisted it up into the ponytail until my whole head was retwisted into a ponytail and then I allowed it to dry like that and doing so it dried stretched you can clearly see my length now um, considering my new growth has been twisted up and I did combine more locks simply because my locks were getting very heavy on the ends and it didn't feel like my roots would be able to support them as they continue to grow. So of course I'm being proactive in reinforcing, you know, my roots during the time that I retwist my hair. And considering I have little to no manipulation in my hair for the three months that I am not retwisting it, I haven't experienced any breakage, any thinning or anything like that. So guys, what I did different this time, normally I share with you guys that when I do my wash routine, I always wash and condition my locks. So this time guys, I wanted to do something different and omit the conditioner just so that I can have something to compare my hair to because I've always conditioned it, like I said, and it feels really, really good having not conditioned my hair this go round. I hear in the lock community a lot of people saying their reasons that they don't put, use conditioner in their hair is for the fear of buildup. I have not experienced buildup in my 12 months on this journey. When I do condition my hair, I always dilute my conditioner with rose water. And so we have part rose water, part conditioner, and I use it as a mist versus rubbing and squeezing it into my locks for it to cause buildup. I'll mist it on, rub it through my roots, wash it out, and then do a cold water rinse. Well, this time, guys, I just washed my hair. I did not do the conditioner, and I did a cold water rinse. Retwisted it into the ponytails, guys. After I retwisted my hair and had a couple of ponies in it, I realized I can just leave it like this. It will dry stretched out, and I did not twist my roots tight um when i did the retwist i retwisted my hair with rose water and vitamin e oil that is it i have been retwisting my hair with oil for 11 of the 12 months that i've been locked one month i did do uh my retwist with flaxseed gel so i just went back to the oil and water and that works great for me my twists are in really good and i want to take it down so you guys can see i don't know if you can see this hang time in the back baby but um <laughs> all right yes this hair is growing and i can better show you guys the growth now because my roots have been twisted so let's take this down this was actually a, the top part of my hair that i retwisted that I just put into this ponytail up here. And in the back, I, when I retwisted the back, it had its own separate ponytail with the retwisted locks in them. And this is how I slept with my silk bonnet and my hair dried overnight. So let's take this down so you guys can see what my hair is looking like after going three and a half months with no retwist and i'm hoping you guys can see because today guys we are using natural light i'm playing around with the lighting because i want to get a little better with it and so hopefully guys you can see what i'm seeing in my my little canon pop-up view i hope you guys can see and i'll move a little closer so you can see my parts are still intact let me just turn around so you guys can see the back.
and you can clearly see that there's some growth in this hair so I am very pleased you know my head is happy because it's got a little maintenance done to it after three and a half months and we know I don't like this neat stuff so I'm definitely looking forward to week three week four of this retwist as my roots begin to grow out I love when my hair fills out and gets really full I don't really care for this tailored neat look just let me let you guys see all of my parts are still intact and like I mentioned a few of my locks got um, combined so that I can reinforce my roots and I'm trying to find one for you guys so you can see that your girl got a couple of two-headed dragons because I had to combine a few locks here's one here you guys can see it it's a couple of them in there but it is whatever not this is not gonna be a very long video I just wanted to come and show you guys my hair since the last few times you guys saw me I had not retwisted my hair in a while and it's growing it's healthy and I'm loving it I just did this on a whim so I do plan to come and show you guys since I just winged it yesterday when I was doing my retwist with the rubber bands by just adding my locks to the rubber band as I retwisted I want to kind of come and do a tutorial on that for all my lock queens and kings who really don't care for using a hundred thousand clips to retwist and also who really desire to have stretched out locks once they dry if you're under dry I'm quite sure it'll it'll definitely dry it's gonna take some time to dry because you have your locks bunched up in a rubber band so it takes some time to dry and I just can't see myself sitting under an overhead dryer for hours while my hair fully dries so I love to air dry my hair I never go out in this winter air with my hair wet or damp because um, you know it's just not a good thing to do I re-added the oils that were washed out to my scalp I didn't really oil my locks I oiled my scalp because the oils that I replenished in my scalp will penetrate the locks and it will you know come through the locks I don't want to walk around with oily locks or oily head oily foreheads you know I'm dark skinned so you know I ain't trying to be out here shining like a light bulb yeah guys so this is my results of retwisting my hair after going for three and a half months with no retwist can somebody say growth yes baby not that it's hanging like that you know I don't want to hang time and like that you know but it's grown significantly guys when I did my initial two strand twist I actually had was wearing this shirt I should put it side by side so you guys can see how far we've come on this journey. Well, I'm gonna show you guys how I did it. Retwisted my hair with no clips, pulling it up into actual ponies and allowing it to dry this way where your locks will dry stretched to, you know, just hang around the house and and you can even go out like that because my hair didn't look bad in the two, you know, the two um, ponytails. It didn't look bad, but like I said, it's the winter time and I was not going out there with damp hair. And if I do need to go somewhere and I've recently moisturized my hair with the rose water and the vitamin E oil, then I will add some artificial heat to dry my hair before I go out in this winter air. So yeah, guys, we got a tutorial coming up on how to retwist and actually band your locks up so that they can dry stretched on our next retwist so as always i appreciate your presence on my channel and i will see you guys in the next video